Hi folks, Bart Barnes here with Clemens Boats. Uh, right here we have the, the 24 foot cobalt cutty. Uh, it has a sandstone hull with a black boot stripe with a white bottom. Uh, what's nice about Clemens uh, cobalt is they leave their, their hulls in the mold for six days. Some of the competitors only leave it in for six hours. They uh, also clean the mold each time after they do it. Uh, this boat also is equipped with a windlass, which is nice in a cuddy. That way you don't have to have someone run out to the bow of the boat. We thought it was a must-have on this model. Uh, also has stainless steel rub rails. Uh, stainless steel hull vents. Uh, cobalt doesn't compromise anything. They do everything to the best of their abilities and qualities. At, they, they set the standard for everyone else. This here is for a fender clip. It snaps right in, snaps out. It's real easy to get your fenders in and out of the boat. Uh, it's quick and easy. Back here we have the uh, Cobalt exclusive swim platform. That back pad there flips around and flops down into the water rather than there being a swim ladder. Uh, it's great for pets and loading and unloading. At the sandbar. As we get up here, uh, like I said, cobalt compromises nothing. They're, the quality that they put into, into their boats, stainless steel gate, this vinyl you can actually clean with acetone and it's the same color all the way through so if you scratch it, it's going to scratch the same color. In here we have lots of storage. This boat with it being a cuddy cabin, we had the full camper top. We have all the Isinglass hanging out in there right now. Um, as you can see, this flips back and forth so if you have a sun pad you want to lay out or if you're cruising you can flip it back this way you have cruising ability in here you have lots more storage um, we have this boat equipped with a 350 mag uh, what another thing cobalt does it's quite nice they have the head separate from the cuddy what's nice about that is if you guys are out on the water and Someone needs to hop out of the water and use the restroom. You don't want to get the cabin all wet or even if you guys are on an overnight and someone needs to use the restroom, you don't have to make the other person get out of bed. Nice cabin here. Uh, we have filler cushions, uh, lots of storage. This is a nice feature to this boat. You have the walkthrough windshield. These come up. The windshield opens and that's your stair to the bow of the boat. Again, this boat has a windlass in it, so it's there if you need it, but you don't have to go up there for the bow. This boat here has the uh, bolster seat, which is nice of what Cobalt does. You can actually sit on this, and this is how I would run the boat underway, but if, you're, if you have a long channel and you do a lot of idling out to the lake, you can flip it down, and you also have a very comfortable seat for idling speed. Uh, this boat has smart craft gauges, uh, depth finder, all of these switches here are stainless steel. They're actually $20 a switch, which the competitor, there's about six, so they really compromise nothing at Cobalt. You also have a tilt steering wheel. Here you have the extra face plate to the stereo. Nice stainless steel foot pad. It's just a very nice eye catcher. Really razzle and dazzles you. Cobalt also is the closest thing to a custom made built you can get. What I mean by that is they have someone come to this boat and fit this carpet to this boat. This is the actual serial number you'll find at the transom of the boat. Uh, competitors, they'll, they'll have someone sitting at a, at a station cutting that pattern all day long with different colors and they don't actually get to the boat and fit it up. What's, what that benefit does is all these, these seam lines here are flawless. You don't have a very awkward gap or anything. It just makes the boat that much nicer. I don't know if you can see it through the camera, but you have diamond stitching through here, which is just outstanding looking if you ask me. Uh, another nice thing about this boat, Cobalt really strides on their biminis. As you can see, there's an extra rail here. What that is, is in some of the competitors, they'll just put a, a strap here. There's no straps flapping in the wind as you're going down the water. Uh, right here you have nice storage. Here's that fender clip that snaps right in. In here is also a cooler. It's built in, drains overboard. 
Uh, this boat has a four speaker standard. A lot of the competitors have only two boats. Got to get your tunes on. Uh, check us out at ClemensBoats.com and don't forget to like us on Facebook. Thanks again, guys.